everybody. Come see on mute. So Max, Sean, and tonight I can't seem to get my camera going I'm still trying to fight uh, dodgy controls and I turned off my steering wheel with the USB plug but I think it uh, killed oh, I think it killed my um, camera with uh, stream OBS so yeah we're, we're just back and forth but I am using an F16 tonight you will have seen this on at least one other video I think I've done with it Somebody's using a sideways uh, alpha jet. You can't use your slew on here. When you land, you fall through. So you got to take off. So, <laughs> no, can't slew onto these things. You can only land on them. But slew mode seems to fall through to a gap underneath. All right, park brakes on, park brakes off. Thank you, I saw that pop up. Let's move up a little. Now, I could probably take off without uh, the need of an assist here. I'll attempt to try that first. Uh, maybe. You know what? I think we will. Flaps down. So we don't hit a helicopter on the way. Brakes on. Only because we've got a, a ramp here. Oh, no, my engine's just died. There we go. There's that faulty controls I've got again. Turned off my controls. What? <laughs> yeah, as soon as you try and uh, accelerate, it, it turns off your controls on you. My engines turn off. I was, yeah, it must be some fuel use thing that they've done with the latest update. Well, not the latest one, but the one that Yeah, probably. I was building it up, but uh, it didn't like it, so. Yeah, you go for it. That Alpha Jet should go, no problem. Those things go really well. Where did you use? Did you put yourself on a uh, little ship, did you? Yep. Okay, I have no throttles at all now. Hello? Controls, we're at 25%. Ah, oh, it put my reverses on, that's why. It put my reverses on and killed it. All right, now we'll try it. We are up, thank you. And can we stay up? Yeah, plenty of the ramp. Come on, you didn't even need a catapult with that. All right, now what we need to do is we need to, okay, so we're in um, the South Atlantic at the moment. We have two Elizabeth class uh, British uh, aircraft carriers and uh, one US can't see the number on it it's like a bug Gerald Ford or something the latest one, I think it might be we also have uh, a few other escort ships not as many as they would normally have but let's try and land on that US one I kind of wish I had no, wow, we just had a C-17 name on Very nice. Okay, so we seem to be doing okay without, oh, I'm still flaps down, that's why. Right. There we go, thank you. Oh, come on, come on. 
Where are you, Stu? No, not mine. Oh yeah, I see you guys. You and Chunk are trying to land on that uh, that thing there. Okay, come on. What's happened to my? Oh, hang on. I've I've turned off the uh, nerdic assist. Connect. Thank you. All right. I forgot I actually turned that off. So we'll go around again. Uh, if I do have automatic, um, well, if it does have automatic flaps, no, I turn them off. Or well, at least I don't have them. Not on this one. And the other two versions of, of the F16 I've got also uh, don't have them, but one doesn't have aftermarket. So let that land on the US ship here. And what I need to do is I need to be able to watch you guys do it as well. So, Luke, how many bloody packages does this game. Uh, decompress he's still trying to get his sim reloaded i hate that but it took me an entire day to download stuff um, because it just kept downloading i always had something else to download there we go tails down thank you i'll take some flaps down thank you take the air brakes on we are coming in way too fast I can't slow this down anymore. Oh, I don't know about that, but I'm hitting an F15. At... Oh! Okay. That just flung me off. <laughs> I saw that. It just flung me miles out. All right, let's try that again. I think I know why it did that. Well, this was practice and muck around, I put in the description, so... Jump the road, jump the road, oh yeah. There we go. Afterburner, thank you. Don't turn my engines off. It did. It turned off my engines. I'm having no end of trouble with flight sim at the moment on some aircraft. So where's this kinetic assist? I need to change the arrestor back to three seconds. I put one two to try and stop sooner. Yeah. Alright, what am I on? Flaps? Yep, right here. Can I have throttle? Can I have my engines, please? Still doing 200 knots, so we're doing all right there. Jerry B says, well, hello, and I'm just watching F1 Chloe. Uh, we'll join up, not worry saying I like, no, thank you, I'm recording that. I was contemplating watching it. All right, got jets, thank you. Back off, back off. Tail hook, thank you. Gears down, thank you. Still got flaps down, this is a long run now. Alright, what I'll do is I'll get myself onto an aircraft carrier and I'll watch with a drone you guys coming in. At the moment I'm going to go and land on that uh, US one. Although it looks like there's something in the way. Something big. Oh, I've lost engines again. Stop turning my engines off. Yeah, yep, yep. Turn off randomly and then potentially start up again. There's something conflicting, I don't know what it is. And then sometimes the reverses will come on. Yeah, which basically just kills the engine. So it may actually be that reverses button. So what I was having trouble with uh, my 737 MAX 8. I am gliding in here at 147 knots. This might be my most smoothest landing if I don't slam into the back of the aircraft carrier. So smooth because I have no engines. I don't use the reverses, I use the kinetic assistance. Arrestor hook. How does the arrestor hook work? 
you turn it on to catch you to deploy the arrest hook and you land within three seconds or stop within three seconds and also take off you've got to um, download the kinetic assistance there's a link uh, under tools or something it's from uh, the same guy did the legacy importer there's a free version and a premium version Hello. I want to get off the runway at least. Can we get the engines running, please? I have no idea. Jerry, say, I uh, can't say jump where it won't, uh, you know, what? don't you dare. Who was quickest? Don't you dare jump. All right, so once I can get this engine up and going and I'll get out of the way, I'll um, have a look at what you guys are doing. I'll probably cut myself. F18, nice Can you move, please, plane? Yep. Thank you, there we go. Alright. I'm gonna go park over near this tiny little helicopter over here. If it doesn't throw me off. Alright, can we park break that there? Thank you. Alright. So I'm still having issues with my controls. Uh, with engine shutting off. Now I don't know whether that's something to do with the, not fuel, thank you. I'll take camera. I want to watch you guys. Alright, what do we got? We got anybody coming in? We got an on fire. Okay, chuck. Gas auto in the F-15. If you use the uh, arrestor hook, park yourself on the, uh, the end of the Are you going for the middle ones? It's usually one of those uh, catapults there, not the uh, red and white line. What's that do? Might just take the name tags off. Alright, park brake on, throttle up, and away he goes. Very nice. Helicopter's buzzing around. I'll have a quick look at everything here. So obviously I am on, is this the Gerald Ford aircraft carrier? What number are we on? There's no number on the conning tower. Conning tower, isn't it? In the front or rear? Deliberately not numbered, I'm guessing. Okay. Uh, a couple of F-35. From where are these 33rd EG 33rds? They don't look uh, as if they're marked with US markings. Where's the US markings? I wonder. Anyway, uh, we're done. Thank you, Asobo. Best insulation ever, says Luke. All right, cool. Uh, we've also got a Osprey down in here. Uh, what else have we got? Got an E3 and a transport E3, I'm guessing. I think they're called E3s. And we've got a Seahawk and we've got a drone. Very cool. VAR95, okay. Got one of those uh, stealth ships that is too expensive to run and too expensive to armor, but uh, supposedly very hard to spot. 
to the radar. We've got anybody coming in, let me know who, who's landing and where. US, okay. Let's get in and uh, watch a few of these. Can we get in the tower? Where is the tower? There it is. No, up. I don't stand on the edge. Yeah, that'll do. The two coming in together. <laughs> F-18, very cool. Oh, very nice. F-15, don't even know they had arrestor hooks, but that's cool. Very good. A biplane. Here we go. Steerman. I don't think he's got arrestor hooks, but he's... Oh, oh, oh uh, through the F-15. <laughs> Uh, uh, yeah, no, it's turning around. All right, anybody else? Flightman 100, how about flying aircraft carrier operations? How about flying it? Yeah, yeah, we were, but I'm having lots of trouble with my, um, with my controls tonight. My engines keep turning off, so, but you tell you what, I'll jump back in and we'll give it a go. I might also change to some different aircraft. <laughs> Who did that? What? Right. We've got an F-18 taking off. All right, I think I've got my engines running and catapult off the side, thank you. All right, see if my engines turn off again. Now I'm not, no hands on the controls, except I'll bring my flaps up. No hands on the controls. It's As in to stop you. Yep, engines are off. And they just died. Look at that. I, I backed off. Nothing. Unbelievable. So this is why I was having trouble tonight. I had trouble uh, yesterday when I tried doing a stream the day before what was it um i tried doing this yeah the max eight and it continued to turn off and i'm not sure whether it is the flight control because i did another stream after that and it worked fine edge the optica ran perfectly the whole time so there's something to do with planes that have some sort of script in them or automatic something or other i believe Tail down, gear down, brakes on because we are going way too fast. I don't think we're going to stop this. I'm going too fast and I can't slow down. That's not cool. Nope. All right, now I've got my jets going. What is with that? Is it going to work or is it not? I don't know. Oh, All right, breaks in. Now we'll actually try and get this to control. So, flight man, it's not working very good. But I may try a different aircraft or two. I might use some of these British ones. Okay, see, I didn't press that. I did not change view inside, and it automatically changed. What? What's pressed? That's on my flight stick. So you 
thinking my flight stick is on its way out, but there's got to be that. Unless there's something else conflicting. It's the Ostra small Cessna type pop plane. Of it. See you. <laughs> Oh yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Smashes my shit from there. My plane flipped over. Oh man, I'm coming at 260 knots. I want slower. I think this is a go around. I cannot get this to go slower. Why are you still on 29% throttle engine? If I get low here, and then I think this will be a go around unless I catch one of the first few wires. No, I missed them completely. Uh, ah, that arrest the hook thing still stops you, but won't let go. So, and I lost control. You know what? Bear with me, guys. I'm going to do a quick swap over of aircraft. guys are swapping so I'm actually going to load out of that and into something else actually try that f-35c where'd it go okay Martin f-35c is a carrier based not vertical landing Give this a try. El Markable, where are you at? I don't have Discord uh, working to find out. Um, ACTC, uh, and I crashed to desktop. Wow, I crashed to desktop. I'm trying to put that in. Okay, um, so the Southern Atlantic Ocean on the, the aircraft systems, uh, aircraft carriers there. Okay, that, that plane's not going to work, so we'll try something else. Do you reckon you can up on my stream since you're not, since flight since just loading up right now? I can do that. Let's mute your channel. Make sure I mute this so I don't get messages. I'm not going to do it while I'm uh, yep, there it is. Thank you. Let's put on screen while uh, while we're waiting for mine. <laughs> so this is what Dre the game is doing, everybody. While my sim is uh, loading up. He's on the end of the uh, aircraft carriers and looking for a, uh, a launch in a prop plane. You need the uh, need to download and install the Kinetic Assistant. You can probably actually download it while still in stream. Chuck, three for three in the PT-17, amazing craft. Ooh, PT-17. That's like the Mark 1 or Mark 2 propeller plane, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Vertigo. Alright, so I'm currently watching uh, Dre's while I get my flight sim back online. So, here's me going, uh, yeah, I haven't crashed on Oz Flight Sims um, stream. I told him I haven't crashed since... Uh, the latest update in France. Oh, sorry, not France. Um, the uh, Nordic. Up 
update 5 and then I get a crash so yay so while we're loading it back in I might just put an exclamation Dre and that should bring up uh, Dre the Gamers channel that's the one I've actually got up on the screen at the moment in the background there I don't see that didn't see that coming up oh there it is thank you and I've also got a bunch of uh, chat stuff you can do for sound effects hola buenos dias buenas noches uh, Michael says can you repeat one more time oh ACTC I think it is um, I'll show you when I get back into the stream uh, as well because I'm um, loading in but I think it's the aircraft carrier right smack between Africa and South America so as south as Cape Town but right smack in the middle of the ocean there. there's a couple of islands we're actually on those set of aircraft carriers at the moment this is ACTC ATCT is it okay AT no ACTC oh that's right okay ACTC yeah Too many people sitting up front. ACDC would also be good, but it's not good. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I've probably got some music that sounds like it. Oh, there's some Shirley, Shirley coming. No, actually, no longer redeem. It's just exclamation marks. So the new thing I've got rid of all that. It's just exclamation Shirley on my Discord. I have put in the current list of sound effects on my channel, so you can type in just. Uh, yeah, I have no results for ATCT. ACTC. Um, Alpha Charlie. Tango Charlie, but you have to have the aircraft carrier group, the latest one loaded. Well, I guess it's the latest one, but I've got the latest one. Um, let's see if I yeah, that, that actually should be in the description the uh, the download file for the aircraft carrier. So if anybody wants to add them and come and join us, they can. The link is in the description. Plane spotter Lucas says mod. Did I put a mod on there? I don't think I put mod. That would be cool though. Or add on. No. Uh, I don't know what I would put there, but if you put in a uh, something like SH, does the carrier work uh, with like that stopping thing? Yeah, yeah, it does. So. If you put in, um, put put the, uh, what's it called again? The, oh wait, did it shut down? Oh, I did too. Um, kinetic assist. Let's see if I can get that on the screen. All right, so we're in game. So there's my kinetic assist. I go connect. Uh, I'll grab a plane. Oh, it's not staying on the top anymore. Okay. Uh, this plane crashed a desktop, so I'm not going to go jumping on the aircraft carriers again with it so my sim is running fairly slowly today anybody else is doing the same no. oh. Oh. oh I think I know why let's go back to live screen thank you I've got a large file in there as the background Well, we got a few F-18s I can use. A C-17, Blackburn, even a Shackleton, Eurofighter. Eurofighter is not aircraft carrier bound, is it? Antonov. Awesome. <laughs> I don't think I have them connected. 
Uh, Alright, let's try this Vertigo thing that uh, you were talking about. It's not really aircraft carrier style. Tomcat is. Yeah, but I'm having trouble with the Tomcat doing the same things with the controls. I'm not happy with it. So I don't know what whether it's Man. a plane or if it's something going on. You know what? There we go. We'll go to the J31. The flaps are automatic on the real one. It's the wing sweep, by the way. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, I, well, I don't mind that, but uh, things so keep keep turning off. So I don't know what's going on with these. All right, so ACTC. Alpha, Charlie, Tango, Charlie. We are in between Cape Town and uh, Rio de Janeiro. There's a bunch of, uh, you know what, I'll put it here. There's a bunch of um, places that we can get on. Let's take off. Now, did that... Did my chat work there? No, it didn't. Oh, why did my? Oh, because you've actually got to start it up. Okay, my sounds are mucked up. My camera's mucked up. I'm not having much luck tonight. There we go. I need chat, but and I crashed the desktop again. Are you kidding me? I am having a no luck. What happened there? I'll work it out. If you uh, several. Okay, so things that don't seem to be working tonight with two crashes so far. Uh, engines keep turning off and uh, even my webcams are not working. Uh, so, might be having a few issues. Don't know what's going on. I can't even get my Streamlabs uh, chatbot to work and communicate. I don't want that on, thank you. Why, why did you even bother putting that on there? Alright, so it's saying stream is offline.
So Planet uh, Spotter Lucas says that he won't, he can't lo load in either because his sim won't, uh, is not working. Wow. World update five for you. I saw uh, Oz Flight Simmer crash several times on his stream. Um, don't know. I uh, don't know what is going on, whether it's something to do with the mod or if it's to do with uh, what we have here, so... Alright, I wonder if I've got this set up now to actually put in some codes that make sounds through my stream. Uh, the rest of them are not working, so I'm saying the stream is offline. Right now it's saying it's offline again, so I, I don't know. While we're loading back in. Uh, this might be a short stream. I might end up having to pull my flight stick apart. Um, if that's the case, my videos may end up just uh, being a little slower to be released for a while. Probably not a bad thing since I go uh, flat out with them anyway. So plain spotter Luca, you can't actually get into the sim or you can't get into the aircraft carriers either. in the background. I got them real I got sound effects. Alright, let's try and take off from our optica. Yeah, your dog sound effects for that optica are very realistic. <laughs> Welcome Garcia mate. Thank you to the uh, subscription and the stream. Welcome. Uh, sorry there have been nothing much but uh, plane crashing so this is where we're trying to get to. Maybe I'll take the... Uh... No. Alright, we'll see if this crashes. If it crashes, uh, I think a third time is not necessarily going to be any better. Although I am using the wrong aircraft. Maybe I should, should go back to the F-16 um, that I loaded in before keep trying it. But this time we're going to try an F8 Crusader. 1970s uh, circa. Livery. Oh my god, we're going to get in. Yay! Alright, that's Queen somebody, Elizabeth class. Somebody go swimming. All right, Max is sinking into the ground in front of me there. All right, I can't tell if my engines are running. I've got my sound down too much. All right, where is my engine idle? 
Don't know. Unfortunately, this one's not pressable. Okay, we're in. Uh, the music's a bit loud, mate. Yep, yeah, okay. Look, no, I just need people to tell me that, so I'm very happy to. And you know what? I'm going to move that one away. I'm over that one. All right, so <clears throat> do I need to start this? I think so. Probably central mirror. All right, so. Oh no, I reckon the engine's running. Okay, so park brake off. We'll get rid of those little chocks around the wheels. Uh, what we'll do is we'll turn on the. Um, what is that cloud assist? Alright, so. I'll put settings and. How do I keep it on top? I don't anymore. Okay. Catapult. Thank you. The rest of hook. Alright, we're on three seconds. So I'm using the. Oh, there we go. Pin it. Okay, I'm using the kinetic assistance. That's this thing here. I have the ability to use my controls. So kinetic assistance is available. Um, I don't think I've got the link on this one. You know what, I'll do it right now. So what we'll do is we'll go here to settings, we'll go to uh, touch and cloud, left click, open website. Yes, thank you. What is it, right click, does what? Reset count that. All right, so I'll put the link uh, Pre-Final Connect update. So that's their web page. I'll actually put that in the description for you guys who are watching now and for anybody else who watches this in the future. Welcome, 18 people. All right, so uh, let's just put that there with, uh, what's it called again? Kinetic. So this is actually, there is a free version and then there's a payware version. So you can use this to take off with uh, gliders and everything. Assistant. Okay, cool. And what I'll do is, uh, for you guys, I'll uh, save that now and you'll be able to get it yourself as well. All right. <clears throat> I can't hear that music at all now. I might just run it up a fraction of that song. Cool, so let's uh, move ourselves up. There you go, the engine just turned off, I think. D2, I, I got control of problems, I think. Let's try that again. The moment I tried to push forward, it turns off my controls. And now my flaps just went down. Okay, I'm gonna have to pull my flight stick apart tomorrow. I have that back up, thank you. Alright, F18 second off. Oh, we dipped down there, didn't you? Hey, pros here in the F14 by the looks of it. Oh, that one dipped down too. Whoa, well, did that just go splash? It's maybe hardware problem? Yeah, I think it's actually my hardware problem. So what happens with the X56 controllers? They sometimes... Um, well, I'm right on approach, aren't I? They sometimes fail with the wiring and you've got to go in and uh, solder up the wiring to make it longer. For what uh, can I use it? So, plain Spotter Lucas, the, uh, the kinetic assist, you can use it for a catapult. I'll launch it up to 210 knots, because I like to um, set that up, and a rest hook. So, what I can do, once I get my engines running, I can't tell if they're running something's not working right problem is I did a whole flight in the octagon not a problem right so with this you can actually uh, deploy the tail hook so if I press where is it oh okay it helps to connect first there we go there you go you see the tail hook came down there at the back 
it's because it's modeled in on this aircraft the tail hook comes down I double tap that again and it goes up if I want to take off I, what I can do is I can get myself into a position wherever I like I put the park brake on I double tap or I can connect to the catapult and I can go ready to launch so I can actually press it with a mouse or I can press it with controls on my keyboard which is what I use hello hello Oh, you're right behind me. Didn't realize that. Alright. Park on the catapult. I'm just short. Alright, so there's no actual mechanism there. I put the park brake on. You can see those little yellow chocks come down on this particular aircraft. I will take one more level of flaps. You can see it actually models this one with. They come way up. Although I don't think I need that. I think I only need that for landing. So I might keep that back down. So what I do now is I will tap the ready to launch or I can actually press it. it makes that beeping noise. I throttle up. And I let go of the uh, park brake and away we go. Wow, it automatically put my gear up. That was not meant to happen. then we can take the flaps up as well and then what we have is the ability to land as well so we can actually go around and use the same thing kinetic assist with the arrest of it now you can set it up on any controller you like or you can uh, just press the mouse button on the screen although it's a lot harder to take your hand off the flight stick Uh, so far it hasn't turned my engine off and I'm doing 500 knots, though I'm not yet trying to land, so who knows. Let's see if it tries to kill me when I get around. So I'll go along. I do need to back off here a bit. What I will do though is take the kinetic assist off here, put it on another screen. Bring this around. We are going way too fast. We're a pedal and a half underneath here for a uh, decent break. Look at that. Oh, that really is effective too. What server is this? Mike D says we are on West USA. We are down the South Atlantic at uh, the aircraft carrier, which is the free mod. Link in the description, in my just uh, YouTube description. At ACTC Alpha Charlie Tango Charlie. Alright, we got. Alright, got a QC Frank over the top of me, mate. Welcome. Alright, Dre. I suggest you also download the uh, Kinetic Assistant free version. Alright, I'm going to slow down with that and I'm going to take another flat level. Look at that, that just sucks in the uh, back there because it. Oh, wow, that really slows down. Pity you can't land with that. All right. Oh, I didn't think I was going to get the tail down there. Now, what it'll do is it will actually slow down the aircraft uh, to a stop in three seconds. And you can actually land on any airport or any ground surface and it will do the same thing, but it's just there as a simulator. Oh, I'm a little low here. No, that's actually pretty good. Oh! Alright, you can send a message to me later or take a picture if you like. Um, so, we are stopped. It automatically brings up the uh, arrestor hook. And now what we can do is flap up. Alright, see you, Dre, mate. Oh, I think I have my park brake on. Yeah, I did. Okay. All right, you're going to take that uh, side loop, all right? Oh. All right, so Mike says, got the cords, thank. Okay, cool. Yep. West USA. 
happy to take as many people I want to. Oh, look at all the people here. All right. <laughs> Couple of, uh, what have we got? An, uh, no roses? No, no Rosie? Rossi? See, 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 no, see? I can't tell because you're, whoa, there we go. There's a takeoff. T45. Right, so you can actually take off from the back. You can take off from wherever you like. Like, I could probably take off here. But, just for the sake of we we kind of pop ourselves onto the catapult. Alright, this is actually a freeware aircraft as well. It is an FSX conversion. I think that just killed my... Yeah, dude. My, my flight stick didn't like that and it killed the engine. Alright, so I've got to start that back up again. And, yes, yeah, so that button where I just pressed look inside, I didn't press that. Something is going wrong with the stick. So I'd say the, uh, the, because I have a button on my flight stick that normally does that, I say my wires are crossed. It, it's got to be the stick. I do have a showcase video of this particular aircraft. Uh, it's doing it again. No, outside, thank you. We'll watch these guys land. Pro's coming in the F-14. Oh, he's gone. Oh, no, that was actually pretty good. It dropped down very quick. Laugh out loud. CNC Rossi. Uh, like the first name. Right. I couldn't tell because there were other people behind you, but I couldn't tell whether it was on or... C and C, but yep. Yeah. Yes, auto and the F15. Don't change views. No, F14. Okay. So my controller is mucking up no end. I'm not moving. I'm not actually sure my engines are as pulled up. Trey the Gamer is still here according to my uh, screen there. CNC Rossi, Max, Stu, Q, C, Frank, Das Auto. Oh, have I crashed? Don't tell me. No, somebody spawned on me, did they? You know, Phantom next to me. Yeah, I thought about taking the Phantom. Yeah. Is that you, Max, is it? No, no, I had the same issue, but also get some stutter. Right, you had stutter as well. Yes. Alright, my engines are working. Okay, so I'm going to put on my park brakes. Good visualisation is I've got those little yellow chocks. Then I know my park brakes on. Then what I do is I go tap, tap. There we go. We've got that beep noise. So what we can do is we can actually flat out this. And then a park brake off and... We were slightly off there. Wow, this seems to have automatic gear at the moment. I don't know what the deal is. Oh, I keep getting inside view. So I'm going to have to pull my flight stick apart tomorrow, I believe. Thumbs up, thank you. That's what I was following me. Let's see if that's what I can keep up. <laughs> He's in the ocean. Uh, you know what, Chuck? I actually don't know if my sound file thing is working because it didn't. Uh, it didn't seem to want to start, so I don't know what the deal is with that. All right. Uh, but so there may not be any file sounds at the moment. Until I can get it uh, to talk correctly. So no end of trouble. I don't know. Is it frozen again or is it just me? No, me too. Okay. All right. We, we, I think we seem to be filling up this area of, of the uh, the ocean. I'm going to try one of these British carriers. All right. Gear down. Thank you. One level of flaps for now. 
tail down, thank you. Yes, okay, cool. Slow down. I'm not going for that one, I'm going for the other one. Oh, there's another freeze. All right, I'll take another level of flaps, thank you. And I'm, you know what? I'm going to go all flaps. All down. I want as slow as I can get. Thank you. Wow, that's a lot of lift. Holy shit, I'm going to have to push the nose down. Take that paddle again, thank you. Oh, do you know what? I'm going to have to bring up one level of flaps. That is just way too much lift for this speed. Okay, at least one decent landing. When I say decent, the landing was decent, the approach was terrible. <laughs> the approach was woeful. All right, at least one decent landing. Uh, and with that ability, uh, does it turn my park brake on? No, it doesn't. Okay, so park brake on. One level flap up. That puts the wing down. Back onto support, thank you. Rest the hook. Full power very slowly and park brake off. And that's the um, basically it's uh, like a fake arrestor hook. Okay, of course there it does alright. And then the engine goes off. Right. Controls seem to be mucked up. But why can I do the the uh, Optica no problem, but all these others seem to be mucked up? I can hear my engines starting again, so I'm just going to sit it here and go pause brake. And while we do, while the engines actually start up, we'll look at how everybody else is going. All right, looks like we've got a C17 climbing for the sky. Wow, yeah, that's not beefed up or anything, is it? Luca Airways, welcome, mate. Welcome to our aircraft carrier. Bit of fun. All right, we got our uh, engines back on, so I will uh, take us out of that. And yeah, but I am having control issues too. So there's a whole bunch of these fleets, uh, aircraft carriers around the, um, the world. They're all part of a uh, freeware mod. I do have the link in the description. Uh, I thought there were more here previously. I thought there was actually some Chinese ones as well as Russian. But uh, maybe not. Maybe I was just trying around one time. A bunch of them. Let's go back for the... Uh, down, we'll take one level of flaps, thank you. Uh, yep, I finally also in the air, okay, cool. I need to slow down. So what I've heard with these X55 flight sticks is that they're wiring in them, um, is a little too uh, flimsy and by using the excessive whoa we've got to bounce but we are down thank you okay CNC Rose that's a decent uh, T45 uh, Max coming in and wow well, there's no way he's landing that no, no, no. <laughs> I'm like nah you're coming in way too fast there yeah nah all right, Das Auto and Luca Airways look like he's coming in behind. So, Das Auto, you're still on the F-14. Can't tell from here. Yeah, it looks like it. Oh, no, hang on. Is that an SU? 
30. It is too. Okay, and the Eurofighter bounced. Oh, well, there's an idea. Try the Eurofighter. Wow, Das Auto takes up the whole ramp, doesn't he? Oh, he's going from the left side. Alright, I'll take the right side. It's funny it's only got one uh, deflection pad here. Uh, wheel on the lock, thank you. Uh, okay, hang on, let me... Okay, I'm ready. You just... Hey, what's Pro doing? Is he upside down? He is too, in a Harrier. Okay, right next to us. You give me the countdown. Three, two, go. Oh, I, I froze at the end of the runway. What happened? Okay. Wow, we both froze. That was like, let's take a picture. <laughs> All right, I'll look back in the stream and watch that. It was like we both froze just for a moment and freeze. There it is. <laughs> That's weird. Yeah, Eurofighter. Mate, I, I should go the Eurofighter. We've got lots of people doing loops here. That's pretty cool. What I might do is bring my plane around, freeze in the air again. Watch you guys. All right, we might pause break that there. If I go like that, can I have control of the drone? Yes, I can. All right, cool. All right, so we'll just park ourselves there for a moment. I do want to see what you guys are up to. Uh, are we all shooting for the Gerald Ford aircraft carrier? Looks like it. Take that 100%. All right, Luca Airways in the Eurofighter. It's got a decent delivery on that. Look at that. It's got stripes and everything. I don't know if that's the one he's using or if that's just the one that comes up with, with mine, but uh, very cool. We've got a Stu coming in. Oh, that's a little steep there, Stu. Oh, no. I yeah, do not it. think you are going to get that. <laughs> All right, Das Auto is coming in in a... Uh, Cobra move. He's, he's he's trying to float facing up. Is he? Yeah, he is. No, he's trying to he's trying to actually go all the way over in an Su-30. Okay. Well, some people try them. Now, is Dre still here? His name's here. Is he inside the ship? No. Okay. Maybe he's still watching. Uh, that stop thing isn't working for me. Now you've got to press connect. Okay, so the kinetic uh, assistant, what you need to do is you actually need to press the connect or disconnect button. And then what you can do is ready for launch or a rest of hook. Rest of hook I think is default three. Catapult is about 180, but I ramped it to 210 because I like it to race off. But if you don't press connect, it doesn't connect. It doesn't do anything. So, just letting you know, do that first. Whoop, CNC Rose, look at that, that's a nice little T45, isn't it? Red Hawks. Okay, who else have we got? Max, are you making your way in this time, or are you going to blast yep. past? Yep. All right, Pro, are you going to be coming around and landing? Well, Chunk just went through in a, I don't know if that was a Spitfire or what it was. And Chunk, are you streaming? He's muted at the moment. Here we go, F-14 coming in. Not streaming. That's actually pretty good, but you realize your wings are in. Oh. Okay, now they're out. I don't know, it just showed up that way. All right, let's follow uh, Pro Limitless in a... Oh, right, he's in the uh, Phantom. Very nice. Somebody's had a little bit of practice with that. All right, that was actually pretty good. It followed in the uh, aircraft very well. 
All right, do we have anybody else that's coming in before I go and start doing some more of this? I'm just Luke, coming in. Luca Airways is making a really wide loop around. Okay, well, we'll go back for Das Auto. Max on the takeoff. Oh, those F-14s definitely drop down, don't they? Right. I might try the F-14 again, but I had lots of trouble with my controls, and I think that's the case. I'm gonna have to pull it apart. Just check that the wires are okay. Okay, Luke, you're gonna launch, yep. Very cool. No, F-4 Phantom goes pretty nice. All right, let's follow a DAS Auto in. It looks like he's in an F-15 now. Yep, and we got a Stu's coming in too steep, mate. Too steep, too fast. Ah, oh, come on. <laughs> right, okay. So I'm going to take this back and jump into my aircraft. Wait, what happened? Did I click off it? Did I? I did too. All right, here we go. Pause brake, thank you. All right, one more go with the Crusader. Looks like Chuck's on the British ship at the moment. Cool. The British ship is pretty cool with the uh, ramp on the end. For those on helicopters, you could also take some of these little uh, frigates or refueling ships uh, that have helipads on the back. off some speed doing a tight turn like that. Actually almost too much speed there. Oh, I'll just have to use the uh, engines to keep it going. Thank you. We'll take a flat. Take the tail. Shut it down. Yep, thank you. Take some gear down, please. There we go. something and then uh, oh, we've got an F-14 taking off, thank you, we've got an F-4 next to me which unfortunately is belly dragging, there seems to be some issue there with those aircraft. Astro Life says hello, hello mate, oh I've had another engine fail, what I'll do is, uh, you know what, I might jump into dev mode and swap aircraft so that we can try some other stuff. Um, I, I do have to say though, I'm having some issues with my controls. Um, so aircraft, I will try an F4, so PHA Phantom, that one will do. Oh, I've got a whole bunch of Phantoms. Wait, I've got the Milvis and the Vitavia. I don't remember which one's which, to be honest. Uh, we'll start with the top one and... Oh yeah, you can't spawn in directly. Alright, okay, well we'll just pop ourselves in the air. Uh, loves 
freezing this. Uh, it was uh, fun, mate. Got a dash now. T-shirt fits amazing. Oh, good. Yeah, I need to get some T-shirts and uh, uh, a hoodie. Um, so uh, we'd love to see a pic with you on it. We don't have to see your whole face or anything. But just you know how it actually would come out on a real person rather than just uh, their fake manic. Yeah, I'm dive bombing from 50,000 feet, <laughs> says uh, Planet Spotter Lucas. I wonder where you went, Lucas. Oh, that's a set of brakes for you. And those flaps lifted it up. Yeah, yeah, um, F4 was... Uh, along with the A4s, Skyhawks, were big on aircraft carriers. Oh, that was pretty sullen, but uh, it, it actually worked. So I've got a couple of these. Um, I think this was a freeware one uh, that I linked in the video description of where I got it from. So people can check my channel, look for Phantom, and you'll actually see. And I think the other Milviz one might be a payware one. Um, back brake on, thank you. What is there, why is there an F-15 sitting sideways on the end of the uh, takeoff? Sean, you have trouble there? I think the auto brake and control turned me off there. That's why I launched, but I was not ready. And yeah, I had to freeze that there. And my flaps went down several levels. And my engine's turned off. Hello. Thank you. Okay. Smackos. Right, so when you have uh, problems with your flight stick and all the buttons do whatever they want, uh, and now, oh, what's it, 1.7,000, never mind, 9,000. It's still going out. Whoa, 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 what's wrong with my controls? Oh, I was not even watching that, I was reading the uh, comments. So my controllers have a mind of their own at the moment, especially the throttle. Uh, my view changes sometimes to inside or outside when I don't want it to. Uh, and my, um, my gear will sometimes come down or my engines will turn off or onto reverses uh, all of a sudden. All of these functions are automatically set on my, um, my throttle quadrant. Uh, throttle controls is probably the best way So um, I'm finding that as I fly, uh, things automatically press or turn off or the likes, which is not very helpful. Uh, we've got two on approach here. Should go down well. That's all that is skimming the water. Lucas Airways, but no, he was coming down and he stopped. Oh, no, he's still going. Well, now that this is actually working, let's see how fast we can go and how far we can go around this island while you guys are all mucking around. I'm going to go flat out. Uh, so we've had a few things not work on the stream, one of them being 
voice chat things didn't work, so I've had a few things going on. Uh, I disconnected this steering wheel that I have connected to my system four minutes before stream started, and then things just went from there, so didn't want to reboot, probably should have. Check out this island while we're here. We've got a cruise ship over here, on RV. Also got a few roads and some this is not loaded in. Now, Stu's over here, he's checking it out. Yeah, so we've got a cruise ship that looks like a potential dock down there. Using the throttle on flat out doesn't seem to affect it. Maybe if I don't press it, it'll be fine. Do a loop around or make another landing. How far in are we? 1 hour 16. Thank you everybody for coming and joining. If you're interested in getting these type of freeware aircraft uh, or even some of the payware ones that um, have been popping up occasionally, subscribe. Come check out all my uh, videos I've made. controls are being an issue. I mean, I might make a video on it, but I have seen other people make videos on it. That's why I know they can fix them. Open them up, fix up some of the wire, and put in uh, decent connections, and then put them back together. It kind of stretches the uh, thin gauge wiring they've got. I want to go over speed. Now look, my gear automatically come down. I did not press that. Gear up, thank you. No, well, I'm sure when I see, everything does work when you press stuff. It's just, it's like it's being pressed when it's not actually being pressed. Which makes me think it's a short circuit in the oh, yeah. um, wiring, which is a known issue for these particular uh, things. Okay. But I didn't know it was a, that that's what will happen. It's usually just your buttons no longer work. Minor, minor working when I didn't ask them to. Uh, what is chunky at the moment? He's going really fast. Is he in a uh, Nick 31 or something? Can you pick on Discord? Okay, thank you, Luke. Firefox, yeah, I decided to take that out just before the stream. Thinking, no, I don't need that big in here. Nobody would use it. And then I thought, no, Chunk might. And then I went, no, nah, yeah, because we land on aircraft. That wrong, didn't I? <laughs> what are you in that I don't already have? Oh, my controls change. You have this. You have this. I think you're in a prop plane because I've actually taken out most of mine. Ah, oh, my engines are off. Yay. And he's going to have to eject. I've got no throttle just before the end of the aircraft. Yeah, yeah. Eject, eject, eject. I've got one, one engine. I could have, if you just. If you had just. Oh, that just falls straight down. All right. I will persevere just a fraction longer. Um, we might just give it another 10 minutes and then I might finish it. So I'll change to the... Another phantom. That might have crashed. Nope, there we go. Oh, 
back up. What's the red and white? Oh, that's Turkish. Okay, we're on a Turkish one now. Oh, this one's definitely got some after burner on it. Okay. Do we have a tail hook? I don't know, I have one. Yes, it does. There we go. Oh, everybody's on the uh, Gerald Ford now, aren't they? Alright. Put that tail down just to drag. I was, uh, oh, the uh, Antonov 225? I thought about putting them on. I, I, I've taken them out of my thing. Thank you, Brett. Haven't done a carry option in a long time. Mike, mate, pleasure. We'll probably just finish this in uh, a little under 10 minutes. Um, it's a bit of muck around fun. I did think about potentially taking off from one carrier and going to another, um, but I wasn't sure which spot. The only ones I seemed to find close enough was maybe Hong Kong to Taiwan, Taiwan Strait. But those ones are um, Chinese aircraft carriers. I don't think it'd be fitting having US or British aircraft coming in doing that. Alright, let's bring this one in back here. This one's got a decent cockpit in it. But I can't see what I'm doing like that. 500 knots! No wonder. Go around. Wow, this one really does go fast. I wonder the Turkish Air Force still uses F4 Phantoms. a short approach. From space, there we go, and take off as a risk for it. And no. No, just no. Just no. Slew? Life says, how's the sim after the recent update? Um, I'm blaming hardware, but maybe it is the sim. Um, but I seem to be the only one having it, where my engines uh, have a mind of their own, my gear has a mind of I think it's all the controls. All of the things for changing view inside and outside of the aircraft um, are on my flight stick. So I go like inside or outside, uh, reverses, turn engine off, on, off, flat, yeah. So all these things keep getting mucked up. Oh, I do have air brakes on. Right. That's not on the bus. Air brakes? Oh. It's not my air brakes are on. Oh, it's my gear. Oh, okay, this one's mucked up then. I didn't like changing. I'm 
can put the tail hook down just in time. Oh, this is a terrible approach. Check this out. Oh my god, can we actually stop? That'd be like, no, we're over the... Yeah, so that's why they power on. Um... That's why they power on. Updating my sim now, hope uh, mine isn't the same. Um, look, if anybody has any power issues the same way I'm getting them, um, please let me know so that I can work out that it's not my hardware, because I'm going to rip it apart. Basically take all the screws out and try and work out if any of my wires are getting uh, pulled out of the, probably a PCB board, um, to, to find out what's going on. Make a stream? Oh, mate. I've, I've watched people um, do stuff. Where's the sea? Oh, no. Hang on, we just hit the ground. Um, let's go back to the next 16. Thank you. Oh, let's try and get into the air before we spawn in something. Hey, it's the same livery I had before. There we go. What I started the stream with. Okay, so that's the Aerosoft F-16. I've only got three or four uh, F-16s now. A D model, which has uh, no interior pretty much. Uh, and a couple of A models. Oh, maybe one just... I see the other British air carrier. I haven't been on my boat for long. I was say I'm coming in too quick, but I have no flaps. So I'll just use the flaps on here. Alright, bit of a muck around stream. Let's see if I can park myself here and watch you guys again, and then I may end up. No. Just use the fabric. Oh. That bounce. Uh, my flaps aren't automatic. Wow. Uh, that didn't work out very well, did it? And engine just turned off. Okay. My engine just turned off automatically. in his uh so you actually dug into the ground every time i see something that you've uh, modified the flight control it digs into the ground there you go that's so all that's that is probably i see your bed uh send on the ground okay it's a little bit uh, <laughs> to the left. It, yeah i kind of <laughs> i kind of crashed it there but um yeah all of yours are always underground there they're always um part way under no 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 yeah, once you touch the deck at about 130 knots. I'm, I'm kind of aware of that. I couldn't get the thing to slow down. I should have just gone around. Um, but I wanted to see what it was doing with the camera. So. Uh, I've got two T-45s, um, so we'll try that one. And it puts me underground, yep, okay. If anybody else, I guess this will come across in the stream in a second, but I am upside down. My outside camera, oh, I think I know why. Yeah. Oh, I just hit the ground. Hit the water, I mean. Okay. Lucky I got damage off. Um, wow, my outside view was upside down. That sounds like Rebel. Like Rebel, mate. Uh, yeah, so my camera was upside down because the drone went upside down when I fell through the ship. I uh, don't know. Okay. 
Okay, so this is this is the one you've actually got to pull the hook down yourself. Okay. See if we can have much more luck with this one. Only one thing wrong with this plane uh, for me, I should be in modern mode where I've been in legacy for a lot of the others. That's probably why I'm Oh, I'm climbing. Oh, oh, thank you. Oh, yes. Trims all the way up. Is that, is that what that was? One fly is coming in nice and quick. I'm barely keeping up with this. Uh, moving there. Well, hopefully, uh, when we get official uh, F-18E, Dre left, but his plane's still there, well, his name tag's there, at least. So I'm not sure. Top Gun 2. Yes. Whoa, okay, I'm on... Uh, I'm on legacy mode, I need to change that. Too fast, too fast, too fast! Abort, abort! Yeah, so, uh... <laughs> no, you <laughs> stopped it then. I still stopped, yes. Um, but yeah, I needed to abort that. Uh, because I am on... You know what, I'll exit that. I'll go here. Good, go to flight cool. model. And we'll go... Modern, apply, thank you, resume. So when you're using FSX aircraft, you want the other stuff. Uh, when you're using uh, non-FSX stuff, you need, uh, you need to have a uh, modern flight model back on. So this might be a little bit difficult turning around here. I'm worried that I might actually find myself over the edge. But hey, if I find myself over the edge, I guess I'll just have to slew up like I have a thousand times already. No, we're good. Okay, cool. Stu's in a helicopter. If in yeah. doubt, get a chopper. Get the, the chopper. <laughs> get the, the chopper. In a T-45, see. I am. It's not a tumor. All right, we got anybody coming in for landing? I'll sit here for a moment. Oh, I didn't press that inside view. It is automatic. If, no if you have no luck with streaming, you can go as an uh, impressionist. An impressionist. Okay. Yeah. Maybe, maybe it's a little bit too good. Uh, now. Try to, try to do that. Oh, Das Auto! To land on the aircraft carrier? Yes. Yeah. The wings are hitting the, the side. Yes. Yeah. I actually have the engine off out of my folder so I can't see it anymore. Oh, Anteater! Mate, I haven't seen you in a while. Is he in an SU-57? I think he is. Uh, well, whatever it was, it just went splash. No, I think it's... And up he goes. I think it's an F-22. All right, let's go for another launch. All right, we're good to go. Power up, thank you. Oh, I need the tail up. What am I doing with the tail hook down? Oh, wait, hang on. Oh, those flaps were automatic. I didn't do that. Tail hook up, please. Thank you. Why? Thank you. That was a bit slow. All right, let's try that again. <laughs> nice one. Nice. <laughs> oh, <laughs> so <laughs> Ooh, Ooh, skip. Whoa! Ah! Oh, 
Yeah, I mean, I didn't hit anything. It did that. I can't believe it did. <laughs> okay, I that that had the uh, the rest of it on still there by mistake. Uh, I tried to get that up with the controls and it turned it on. So that's why that uh, both took off. It's a 747 on that. Yeah. Okay. Well, he just landed it. An applause. A C T C. That was a nice one in front of me. Yeah, but the last uh, 300 feet was very, very dangerous because I was too slow. Taking off this could be a nightmare. We've still got a few people watching. Welcome, guys. Yeah. We um, have had disaster with my controls continually to turn off uh, the wire and on the play. Um, keeps turning off the uh, the engines on me or hits reverses. There we go. The gear just no. Oh, and my engines off. Yep, engine's off. Welcome. Flaps. Welcome to Flight Simulator where the ocean is only 20 feet deep. Ah! Something. What happens when your engine turns off? Yeah, I hit the back of the air carrier. Is that working? Yeah, it's working now. Don't you have a, you have a game pad or something like this? Uh, yeah, but I'd have to disconnect my flight stick. My my throttle quadrant, which has got all the controls on it, including landing gear. So what happened was my landing gear went up, my engines went off, my flaps went down. Like all that happened all at once, so basically all the buttons pressed on it. Oh, uh, did we just freeze? We did. Yeah, so, uh, we, uh, did you just change planes or something? Yep. Oh, there we go. That's what's going on. It's only it's I'm in the water, so the best I could choose is the water. I can't see you in the water, but I can't see we Thank you. Oh, too much. Alright. I did not do that. I did not press my interior button. Thank you. Alright, let's try and get this as slow as possible. And float it in. I'm, I'm on uh, life weather, by the way. It's a little bit windy. <laughs> Dre seemed to have less, left his camera on the end, or his plane on the end of the uh, carrier, and it leaves his name there as well, which is actually kind of annoying. This is in the way. Oh, I've not come in quite the right angle. Oh, I think the engine's turned off there. They did too. Yep, my engine's turned off, everything turned off right as I got. It's like I've got f fault. Oh, because I didn't, uh, I didn't put the the um, landing in because the hook's already down. Yeah, okay. I have no throttle. Yep, no throttle, no engine. Even even uh, trying to get this thing. Um, slewed up and, and it won't won't start <sighs> all right maybe I'll make a stream on how to pull apart an x55 throttle uh, and fix the wiring and maybe burn it <laughs> no 
<laughs> it's so hard to get uh, controls these days. I don't want to. Uh, I don't want to uh, lose it. We have, have we? Have we been waiting for it, or have you been waiting for it? Because I think you're the one talking about it. How do I turn this over? Thank you. And the engine's turned off again, has it? It looked like you're about to fall off, Rebel. So you half your half your gears like off the side. All right, now I can see you on the uh, carrier. Oh, engine's turned off and I've gone... Oh, you turned it on to... Um, oh, and I turned my, put my... Put my gear up automatically, turned my engines off, turned me on reverses. I'm, I can't handle this anymore. Alright. I'm going to pop it down. Uh, I'm going to basically get myself over onto a ship here somewhere. What have we got? You got a landing pad on the back of yours, haven't you? Yeah. Ah, oh, but I can't land there, can I? All right. I don't think that'll actually stop there. I think it'll just fall through. Yeah, it did. Sitting inside the ship. All right. Well, we'll just say inside the ship. And my camera's upside down. That kind of sucks. All right. The last few minutes of the stream. What are we up to here? Um, looks like my controls have seriously got some issues going on. Okay, so we've got a 7.3, what is it? A 3A? A380? Is it? Oh, it's a 777, right. So it comes up as a A380 with the pointy nose. Yeah, it doesn't know what it is. It just knows it's big. All right, we've got a stew in a helicopter who's just been hanging around watching, I think, now. Chunks come looking for me, can't find me probably wondering where did he go he's hovering around he goes I can see his name tag but I can't see his uh, aircraft because you can't land on the back of those ships you can try it but I think you'll end up exactly where I am inside oh, don't tell me you can land on it You have landed. Okay, you can't slew onto it. Then, right. What did you say? We do believe you landed on it because you can't slew onto anything. It won't let you slew onto any of them. Right, now this one says don't shoot. Keep going in and out, in and out. All right. All right. So autopilot was on there. That's what happened. Okay. I wonder how slow I can go in this. <laughs> what? Alright, 
Let's see what we can do with landing a plane in the most ridiculous place. Don't shoot. Oh, I lost speed. What happened? Are you kidding? I did say how slow can I go. Obviously not slow enough. Yeah, I was too busy watching the, uh... Hello? Pull up! Pull up! Pull up! Pull up! Oh, are you kidding? Pull up, you retard! It's... Retard! 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 <laughs> yeah, it's like, I'm trying! I'm trying! Okay, now we're doing 140. This is ridiculous with the flaps. Yeah, yeah, we know. It's, it's, the, it's the word that they choose to use that it's like, well, okay. Could have chose something else, maybe. It, it just means that you have to come to land. No, no, it's obviously push the throttles back when you land. Crash! Crash! Oh, you go straight through that. Okay, well, we'll keep going then. No, we won't. We won't go very far. All right. Whoa, that is not cool. Why am I going around in circles? That ought to look pretty funny on the uh, stream. See if I can land on the back of that. Maybe the other one over there. Maybe that's got a longer. Um, no, do notice there's no submarines here. Uh, in some of these, they have submarines. I don't think you can see them. Oh, sometimes when they pop up, um, they're they're on the, the fleet uh, on the mod has uh, submarines on them. Well, it's not the same jet fighter as I started off with, but um, it is military. US military, don't shoot. Make this my last one. I think this is the back of a cargo ship. I don't know if that's got a deck on it or not. Oh, we've stalled. And it just tips over. What? Why did it just tip over? Like I just lost all all um forward momentum all of a sudden as if the wind uh, stopped it. It's a Japanese made F-16. And there goes the engine. Engine out. <laughs> oh, you can actually saw on that. Wow, you actually got a landing guy there, chump. That's pretty cool. All right, look, um, Tudor. Hey, I saw the tutorial vid on how to download planes on Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020, but I didn't understand how to install them if you don't have Microsoft Flight Simulator X. Uh, yeah, you can put it in a temporary folder and then install from there. Um, what I might do is I might make an updated version of video very soon, probably in the next week or so, especially if I'm not able to use my flight stick until that's repaired. And, um, and uh, make a video for you showing how you can actually just 
um, install by putting into a default folder. So you need to make your own folder. My engine turned off again. Okay, it keeps turning off. Uh, to land on the aircraft carrier, yeah. Uh, successfully. So hopefully two to that makes sense to you. Just put it in a default folder somewhere. I have no, okay, so I actually have no throttle now. It won't go up and down. All right, so I think that's probably a good spot to leave it. Uh, my plane's stuck in the wall there anyway. Good job, Chunk, landing your H135. Uh, very cool. And we got a DAS Auto trying to land something large in the water on the back of our ship. Not quite working. Look, it's been a bit of fun, a bit of a muck around. Uh, but I'll probably actually end that there. Look at Max trying to uh, land something over the top there. Oh, there we go. Das Auto just dropped it on top and through he goes. By the looks of it. Alright. Uh, thank you everybody for hanging around and watching. Let's see if we're going to move this out from here and look. Uh, not a lot of success with controls that are giving up on me so I'll, I'll have to work out what's going on. Everybody's come to join me on the same trip. Alright, thank you very much everybody who did watch. Uh, we're in the Southern Pacific. The mod is in the description. You can download it. Um, the Kinetic Assistant mod is also in the description. Um, there, I believe there's a free version and a payware version that gives you more options. Good for glider flying. Other than that, for everybody else, thank you very much for watching and uh, have a great evening, morning, day, whatever it might be. Cheers.